Sup folks, it's Ray Pooperton III with another Infinite Warfare Raven the Redwoods video. Today I'm going to go over everything you need to know about the Frog Memory Charm. The Frog Memory Charm allows you to sprint through the water. This can be very helpful for parts of the Easter Egg and is incredibly helpful in general while running at the beach by the docks. There are 10 Memory Charms in Raven the Redwoods. Each award you with a mini perk when you attach them to a weapon. To get the charm, you must find it at one of its two possible locations, find the placement location, place it, and perform a ritual. When in rave mode, the spot you place the charm will be marked with a blue ball of energy. When the ritual is done correctly, the charm will flash, you'll hear a completion noise, and you will be able to attach it to a weapon. Once you do attach it, a voiceover will play, giving you more to the storyline. They cannot be attached to melee weapons or wonder weapons, and since you only have a max of three weapons you can have, up to three charms at once. They do not carry over to other weapons if switched out, but you won't have to repeat any steps to go back and attach it to your new gun. Once you attach it to another weapon, a different voiceover will play. The ability is not specific to the weapon you attach it to or only active when it is out. The weapon just acts as a charm slot, so to speak. Now down to the specifics of the frog charm. The frog is found in one of two spots. The first location the frog can spawn is in the trailer by the stage in the recreation area. Open up to the outer ring of the stage area and in the corner there is a trailer. On the back side of the trailer where it's open is a spawn location. Note, you can see the frog in this spawn from where you pick up the propeller piece. So if you're trying to be efficient with your money, check if it's there before opening unnecessary doors. The second location is in the dock area by the lake. Head up the stairs and into the bait shop. The frog will be sitting in the plastic chair here. Once you have the frog, head over to the swamp by the mess hall. This ritual cannot be done without a rave pouch, so if you don't have one at this point, kill zombies until one drops the pouch. At the very end of the swamp next to the tunnel entrance, on the left side is the placement for the frog ritual. Place your frog here and run up to the fire in front of the mess hall and toss in a pouch. Once in rave mode, a bunch of frogs can now be seen hopping around in the swamp. You must rave pound these frogs. To do the rave pound, jump off high ground and press the melee button at the top of your jump. This will cause you to pound the ground with your fist. Note there are a few embankments that are high enough to ground pound off of near the sides of the swamp. They are very finicky but this one seems to work the best. Other than this mound, you will have to run up and out of the swamp, across the bridge, and jump off the embankment back into the swamp to do the rave pound. Do this on all of the frogs and you will hear a completion noise. This one is hard to hear over the ground pound, but if you don't see any more frogs, just go ahead and go check if you can pick up your charm. Once you attach the frog to a gun, you will notice if you're in the water, you can now sprint. And that's all there is to it for this charm. I hope this guide helped. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more Raven the Redwoods videos coming soon. Subs and likes are appreciated. Peace!